this is an interview preparation session right so those who are in this process it will be very helpful for you those who are in a position to conduct interview this will be very helpful for you so one by one i'm uh, just telling you the questions just note down that first question still with still with 0 0.4 0 0.4% is option a low carbon steel option b medium carbon steel option c high carbon steel i repeat still with carbon percentage 0 0.4 is a option a low carbon steel option b medium carbon steel option c high carbon steel second question when chromium is added to steel when chromium is added to steel dash property is achieved dash property is achieved i repeat when chromium is added to steel, dash property is achieved. Number three, engine valve, engine valve is produced by dash process. Engine valve is produced by dash process. So you have to mention the manufacturing process name fourth camshaft is produced by dash process camshaft is produced by dash process standard used for standard used for gdnt is dash standard used for gdnt is dash number six following gdnt characteristic following gdnt characteristic is used is used for threaded hole following gdnt characteristic is used for threaded hole option a parallelism option b angularity option c position option d run out number 7 a shaft is provided with a shaft is provided with Following GDNT characteristic, the shaft is provided with following GDNT characteristic. Option A, flatness. Option B, run out. Option C, angularity. Option D, position. Next, dashboard of a car. Dashboard of a car is produced by dash process dashboard of a car is produced by dash process number nine for mounting of the component for mounting of the component following gdnt characteristic is provided option a flatness option b concentricity option c circularity option d run out number 10 bronze is made up of bronze is made up of dash and dash so you have to mention the alloying elements I repeat, bronze is made up of dash and dash. Number 11, splines are produced by 
नंबर वन और ऑप्शन ए बोरिंग ऑप्शन बी ब्रोचिंग ऑप्शन सी होनिंग ऑप्शन डी रिमिंग नंबर ट्वेल्व फॉलोइंग इज नॉट फॉलोइंग इज नॉट अ थ्री डी ट्रांसलेटर ऑप्शन ए आई जी ई एस ऑप्शन बी एस टी ई पी दट इज टेक ऑप्शन सी डी एक्स एफ ऑप्शन डी एस टी एल नंबर थर्टीन प्रोडक्ट एक्यूरेसी प्रोडक्ट एक्यूरेसी ऑफ प्लस माइनस पॉइंट वन एम एम कैन बी अचीव बाय कैन बी अचीव बाय ऑप्शन ए सैंड कास्टिंग ऑप्शन बी फोर जी ऑप्शन सी प्रेस टूल ऑप्शन डी इन्वेस्टमेंट कास्टिंग ऑप्शन ए सैंड कास्टिंग ऑप्शन बी फोर जी ऑप्शन सी प्रेस टूल ऑप्शन डी इन्वेस्टमेंट कास्टिंग राइट सो टेन मिनिट्स इज अ ब्रेक डू दिस एक्टिविटी सो दिस इज अ इंटरव्यू प्रिपेरेशन सेशन एंड from these examples you will understand how to prepare for the interview if you have any doubt related to this questions you can type in the chat box and then we have to start this activity so i'll just go through all these questions and i'll give the answers first question steel with carbon percentage 0.4 is a medium carbon steel so three slabs are there point up to 0.3 it is mild steel or low carbon steel 0.3 to 0.6 medium carbon steel and above that it is high carbon steel when chromium added to steel corrosion resistance and hardness is achieved that is answer third question engine valve is produced by forging process so the answer is forging process fourth one camshaft is produced by again same answer that is forging process but nowadays casting is also used forging is also correct casting is also correct standard used for gd and is as what is that asme 14.5 m revision is 2018 number 6 following gd and characteristic is used for a threaded hole the answer is position Number seven, a shaft is provided with following GD and T characteristic. The answer is run out. So all revolving components run out is provided. Dashboard of a car is produced by plastic injection molding process. Number nine, for mounting of a component, following GD and T characteristic is used. That is flatness. So in GD and T, we have to understand what is the function. As per that, we have to provide that characteristic. bronze is made up of copper and tin copper and tin number 11 splines are produced by broaching process following is not a 3d translator the answer is dxf so igs is a 3d translator step is a 3d translator stl is a 3d translator means 3d model of one software can be that model can be transferred to another software by using these translators but dxf is a 2d translator that is for autocad to katia drafting katia drafting to creo drafting that is dxf and 13 product accuracy of plus minus 0.1 mm can be achieved by investment casting process okay so friends thank you for joining this session